Hello everybody, welcome back. So for today's video, I decided to accept a subscriber suggestion to make myself into a soft girl. So that's what we're gonna be doing today, a soft girl transformation. But first things first, what is a soft girl? So according to this article I found on CNN, the soft girl is the half medium between Visco and E girls. She's emanating the half eyes Visco girls are known for, which is also totally done with the theatrical makeup and accessories that are loved by e girls. So, yeah, that's it. Just like the E girl transformation video I've done, I looked for some inspiration on Pinterest for soft girl. So, first I looked for makeup inspiration and Turns out the soft girl makeup is a lot like the girl makeup, just a little softer. So I think I'm gonna be doing something like this. Baby pink eyes with eyeliner and a lot of blush. And after I'm done with the makeup, we're gonna choose the outfit and I'm gonna show you the inspiration that I looked. So yeah, let's do it. I have already applied some moisturizer to my face, so now I'm just gonna begin with the foundation. You know, I love this soft girl aesthetic. I think it's probably one of my favorite popular aesthetics, especially the makeup. I think the makeup um, is very similar to what I wear when I go out. I love some good pinky eyes and good eyeliner, so. I really love those videos of people turning themselves into different aesthetics and I think it's something really fun to do, especially right now that a lot of us are really bored, stuck at home. I mean, do you ever get bored with yourself, like bored of your face or bored of your hair? I get bored with my hair all the time. I love changing my hair. I began my year with bangs and then I let my bangs grow out and then I dyed my hair pink and then I let the pink out and became blonde again and then I did this, my hair. And now I don't know what's gonna be my next step but I know it's gonna be pretty exciting. I'm actually thinking about dye my hair pink again because it was really really beautiful and I kind of miss it. I'm thinking maybe I'm gonna dye green or blue. I don't know, I just want to have my hair in like any possible color I can. I mean that's the perks of having bleached hair. So now we're gonna move to the eyeshadow. I'm gonna use the same eyeshadow I use on my e-girl transformation, which is this pink color from my Dream Street palette from Colourpop. It's called Sweet Dreams. This is like my favorite eyeshadow ever. Ever since I got this palette, I've been wearing this pink eyeshadow like all the time. Every time I go out, I wear this pink eyeshadow, even though I mix with some other colors. I always wear this pink eyeshadow. I've been watching a lot of this aesthetic transformation videos and I'm thinking about doing more videos like this because they are really fun videos to do and I see a lot of you guys like this kind of video. My e-girl video had a lot of positive comments. So I'm thinking about doing more of this transformation videos. So now I'm gonna put some tape so I can finish applying eyeshadow and then go to the eyeliner. I like makeup being a little messy, you know? I don't like when it's all perfect. I, I think it's boring. I prefer makeup a little messy. So I'm just gonna apply a little of this baby pink eyeshadow right here in the inner corner. It's called Elfish. Okay, we're done with the eyeshadow, so now I'm gonna skip to the eyeliner. The most difficult part. I'm gonna, now I'm gonna take the tape up so you can see it. I 
okay, definitely not good, but acceptable maybe. Moving on, now we're gonna do the brows. Now I'm using my brow product from Benefit. Now I'm gonna apply a little bronzer to like give my face some shape but not too much because this looks more about the blush okay now finally i'm gonna apply the blush my favorite one papa don peach by Too faced so now i'm just gonna apply the highlighter That's it. Now I'm just gonna apply some lip gloss and the makeup looks done. Okay, so we're done with the makeup and now we're gonna choose the outfit. So here's what I thought. I got this oversized white pants and this really cute baby blue top. I think we're gonna go with this because I don't have many clothes that match this aesthetic. So, so yeah, I think we're good with this. Okay, so outfit done. And now we're just gonna have to go with the hair. For the hair, I know in this aesthetic, they use a lot of this on the hair so I thought maybe we we're gonna go with these ones that are very cute and these blue ones match my top so I don't know, I'm gonna try both and see which one fits better okay, these are really really cute but I don't think I liked it with these outfits so I'll just try these ones and see if it works better Okay, I think this looks way better. I really like this look. Uh, that's definitely something I would wear. I almost forgot the shoes, but for the shoes, we're gonna go with white Converse sneakers. Okay, that's my final look. Okay, that's it. I think we're done with our soft girl transformation. Now, what do soft girls do? I mean, when I think about girls, I can picture girls playing online games. When I think of cottage core, I can picture someone baking something or having a picnic. But when I think of soft girls, I don't really know if there's something that we can picture them doing. So I think I'll just have to stick with trying to look cute. That's it for today's video. I hope you guys like my transformation as much as I did. So yeah, if you like this video, please don't forget to give some thumbs up and subscribe for similar content. And hopefully I will see you guys next week. Bye bye!